Hi, my name is Christian Scoresmith. I'm the president of the Robert Burns Society of Seattle and the first vice president of the Caledonian and St. Andrew Society of Seattle, the uh, Seattle area Scottish cultural organization. And one of the things I love about Robert Burns is that when you learn his poetry and his songs, you get to hear echoes of the way English might have been spoken in centuries past. Uh, um, because Scots, the, the Scots dialect, uh, preserves a lot of those pronunciations and forms uh, that were more prevalent in Middle English or even early modern English. And one of my favorite examples of that is a song called Call the Yows to the Nows, which we'd probably pronounce Call the Yews to the Knolls. Uh, Yews being uh, small female sheep and Knolls being, of course, part of the pastoral landscape. And uh, and the whole rhyming scheme of the song is built around the, this older pronunci pronunciation. Of course, with Robert Burns, it seems like everything ends up being a love song. And so it's the, the song is ostensibly about uh, calling the, the sheep to this particular area. But it might actually be more about who else is in the knolls waiting to join you. So... Call the Yows to the Nows by Robert Burns. Call the Yows to the Nows. Call them where the heather grows. Call them where the burnie rows. My bonnie dearie. Hark the mavis even unsung. Sounding Cluden's woods among Then a falling let us gang My bonnie dearie We'll get down by Cluden's side Through the hazel spreading wide Out the waves that sweetly glide to the moon Say clearly, fair and lovely as thou art, thou hast stolen my very heart. I can die, but can a part, my bonnie dearie. Call the owls to the nows. Call them where the heather grows, call them where the burnie rows, my bonnie dearie. Happy Burns Night. <laughs>